Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about content creation because we are about to make together a calendar for wallpaper. Welcome, my name is Justine Lamer. I am a social media consultant and a content creator. But I love to show you how to create amazing and unique content as well as give you some social media tips. So if you are interested by any of these content, don't forget to subscribe to my channel to never miss any of my future uploads. With that being said, let's get into today's video. I am going to show you how to make a calendar phone wallpaper. I am going to show you how to do so on Canva. So you can find Canva on your computer, on your iPad, or on your phone. I use Canva on my computer. You can do what I'm about to show you with the free version of Canva. But if there is anything that I'm using that is from the pro version of Canva, know that you can use something that is free because a lot of things in Canva is free and you can actually do a lot of things with the free version. So don't even worry about that. So basically, you will need to find the size of your phone screen. The thing that I love to do to never get wrong is to use the Instagram story size which is 1080 to 1920. Since we are talking wallpaper you will need to find a background that you love. It can be a picture of your family, it can be a simple color. If you don't have any ideas of what kind of background you want to add you will see that Canva has a ton of options when it's about photos but you can also go on Unsplash to find whatever pictures you like and so since we are going to make a calendar out of the wallpaper you will put the months for example we are in December so obviously I'm going to make a calendar for the wallpaper for December and I'm gonna use Christmas things because December is all about Christmas without further ado we are going to go on my computer in Canva follow along all right guys, I'm on my computer. I am recording my screen, so let's go. We are going to start by create a design, obviously, and we are going to look for Instagram story. That way we already have the 1080 by 1920. Easy, right? So you are selecting the once you on this, you really don't care about what is going on on your side because you are making really something else that on Instagram. Sorry, obviously, you just wanted the side. As I said, we want a picture, so you're going to go in photo, and from here, you're going to see what is pro or what is free for you to use. You can go in filter if you are using the free version of Canva, just select free and apply filter. From there, you will, you know, only have things that you can use that are free. Search photo and let's do Christmas because I said I wanted to make a calendar fun wallpaper for Christmas. So our free option is still on. So let's see what we can get that would be nice for Christmas. All right, what about this one? I think it could be a really cool one. What I'm gonna do is just move it this way and obviously I wanted to take the entire screen and I think about put the numbers on that paper and put the December over here. So now that you found your background, your wallpaper, you want to add your text. So you're gonna go on text over here and you're gonna do add a head. Make it a little bit bigger, see how it goes over here. Maybe like somewhere there. Obviously you wanna write December. I have this font already selected for me. However, I can change it. I want my December to be white and I'm gonna add some effect and I want to add some shadow. So let's see which way, maybe this way and I wanna blur it a little bit and I want my shadow to be black. There you go. So you can play with the offset, direction, blur, transparency and obviously choose the color that you want. And as I said, you can also change the font. So I'm using Sets and Heal here, but you can do 
See, it says you can write calligraphy, so let's try that. So here, when you see that little crown, that means this is for uh, Canva Pro users. So if you don't have Pro, just use the fonts that don't have that crown beside the name. Okay, I really like that playlist script, so I think this is what we're going to use for this one. And we can even put the December a little bit sideways to match that paper here. I'm going to add another text, so I'm going to add a subheading and I'm going to write 2020 because this is December 2020, right? And same, you are going to choose a font for it. It can be the same or it can be different. And why not changing the color with a cool red? Obviously, I'm going to add an effect, which is going to be my shadow, and I'm going to make this shadow white. Well, that sounds pretty nice to me. So now we have to do the number. So for you to not be wrong, like make it right, you can use the calendar on your phone. So this is the calendar for December. So obviously, I'm going to make sure all those numbers uh, are looking the same that on the calendar. Also, the little trick here is instead of doing one, two, three like this, just do one and a space to space. That way as space means he let a little bit of space in between uh, those numbers. <music> I'm going to space this with line high and I'm going to make it like this. wallpaper now that your design is done and you're pretty satisfied with what you've made you only have to download your work into png so once it's download is going to go into the download of your computer and you just have to add it to your phone here is the wallpaper so as you can see cut here and there so what we can do is resize the december and move over a little bit on numbers but uh it looks pretty cool so anyway guys i hope you enjoyed today's video i hope you are going to make each month amazing calendar font wallpaper as usual if you learned something today like this video and don't forget to subscribe to never miss any of my future uploads until next time take care bye